Hey guys, welcome to my channel Harshiro Edu. My name is Garima and today I am going to share my experience on random motors case study. So before I start, I just wanted to tell you I am MBA grad from Liverpool Business School and IMT Ghaziabad. And uh, this case study is, is actually what I had done but when you do it, make sure that content is original and or else uh, your marks will be cut because uh, they do check uh, about uh, the things like you have not copied it uh, from somewhere so random motors case study will be uh, used for uh, setting a detailed business context for you you will be required to put yourself in the shoes of the lead business analyst at a random motors company and make certain database business decisions to make the profit for the company and uh, for this project, uh, your submission uh, will be actually in the two parts. And uh, you have to submit three documents. One will be related to hypothesis testing in, in make a folder like this. And then one will be related to hypothesis testing. Then uh, one is your PDF actually where you would answer all the questions. And then uh, next is a regression analysis. So I'll just scroll it down and uh, you can uh, read it yourself. So the question number one is related to formulate the null hypothesis to check whether the new models are performing as per the desired design specifications. This is its answer. Question 2. Formulate the alternate hypothesis to check whether the new models are performing as per the desired design specifications. Next question is, in order to comment on whether the design specifications are being matched or not, perform relevant hypothesis test and calculate the p-value for each what will you conclude assume you are performing the test at 95 percent confidence level next is you have learned about the possible errors that might result from the hypothesis test what type of error is more expensive for random motors based on hypothesis they are testing why assume that you need refund all your customers if your cars deviate from specifications so answer is if random motor fails to deliver the top speed and mileage figures it would be more expensive as they would be forced to return all the money back to customers Question 4 is develop a regression equation for each model at 95% confidence level. From the reg regression equation predict the sales of the two models. Question 5 based on sales prediction what is the overall predicted profit for Reclinate model and Marengo 32 model. So assume if you are a CEO and you wish to invest in the model which is predicted to be more profitable. So which model you would invest in? So this is just to give you an idea. You can calculate your answers too. Now I will show you my excel sheets. This is my data.
this is regression analysis for both the models model 1 all the questions are answered well model 2 So guys this is just for reference So that is all from my side. If you have any queries related to this case study, please come back to me. I will try to help you. And please subscribe to my, subscribe to my channel if you like it. Uh, it will actually help me, uh, boost me to make more videos like this. Thank you for now. You have a great day.